There's your time check, folks, 5.44 a.m. I don't know what got into me. There's two coffees, cinnamon rolls, sausages, smoothie. It's kind of winding down in terms of the guide season for Bradley and I, so we got a day off to go do some fishing. Welcome back to another video, you guys. Today? Oh, oh wow. wow. <laughs> me, Bradley, Mav, Drift Boat, Floating River. It's early fall. We're gonna throw streamers. We're just gonna have a day of fishing. Guides day off. Let's do it. It's better than anything. We didn't we didn't show you we didn't show you any of the beginning, getting everything together. Boats are already in the water. Let's go fishing. Enjoy. Oh wait, but you know how we always start this. Rock, paper, scissors. Whoever wins gets to fish first. On shoot. On shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Oh! You're good. I was gonna say to start. Let's just, just start. You don't have to back row. We I mean, just move. <laughs> oh, that's why. That's what it is. You're <laughs> anchor. <laughs> I was like, why are we not? <laughs> I mean, just... Joseph, that was stupid. Back row. That was really stupid. I do, I do apologize. Ooh. You did shed a layer, correct? I did shed like, you said that it's okay. Well, I'll be always wished, I've always wished. There he is, wow. Just missed it again. All right, update. We're about three quarters of the way through the float. Really? It's, huh? Yeah. Three quarters of the way? I Why kid. I'm there? just kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. How far are we actually? Like not even not even close to a quarter. It was a joke. Kill him. Yep. Yeah. Really? Well he's on it, but he didn't touch it. Just like rose to the column. I even do another one in there. A little bit, a little bit further. Yes, sir. I like that one. Oh, come on. There he's on it. Yeah. Yeah. He charged out. All right, folks. Bradley has his shirt off. He is trout spay fishing. I'm in the drift boat. We floated, I would say, about an eighth of this float, just streamer fishing. Sun's come up, it's way hotter than we expected. It's supposed to be some cold front weather coming in tomorrow. So maybe this afternoon we get some cloud cover and maybe the fishing will pick up, but we pulled off, let Mav chill on the island, got our trout spay rigged up and we got our nymph rod rigged up because today we're just fishing. We're not trying to catch a fish in any certain way, just floating and fishing. So everything's rigged up, let's keep rolling. I personally don't think I got him at all. Right there's good too. Zero hero. Zero hero. Let's freaking go, dude. Good job, dude. Zero hero. Oh. Oh. Oh, we 
first fish of the day. Oh my gosh. Brad, you were just yelling zero or hero. It was literally, it's been a kind of a tough flow for the most part, just ripping streamers around and we had one good grab and that was it. And then we we're kind of just keep going and I literally yelled out loud, zero or hero, Joe. And honestly, I actually, my finger slipped again. I missed one eat because my finger slipped because I didn't pinch the cork. And I slipped again on that fish, but I knew he ate it really hard. So I just kind of like almost trout spent, trout set sweet. Stuck him, super stoked. <laughs> How you, Joe, is there? Pretty tough scenario. I'm coming down main current. Brad just throws it and really, really fast, super shallow, riffle drop, shelf type water. And this fish set itself 21, 22 inch male. Just a perfect buck. Yeah! Perfect early fall buck. But we're going to keep going. Let's. That was a confidence booster. We were losing confidence. And he just goes, with own streamers, dude. It's one fish or zero. And that was a hero fish. Wow, I really like this fly. This is what I need. Oh, I really like this fly. Yeah, that's it. That's it. Here we go. Here we go. The confidence is back. Baby. I'm back. I'm back. Go I'm back, baby. Eats, do that thing. We should go to the left. Wherever you want, man. Oh, wow. Bro, get. Why aren't you stripping? <laughs> what? What's going on? There we go. Goodness gracious. <laughs> <laughs> I don't remember! Joe, do you remember what, what I don't remember how to fly fish! That means you know what you have to do now. We got one behind the tree. <laughs> here you go, here you go. When you see the fishy, you tend to react. That's the worst thing you can do. Ready? There you go, and drop a lot of line. That was a much better anchor job. Job guide. Now you let go. <sighs> there we go! Sweet cutty. That's my first fish of the day. <clears throat> Make sure he's ready to go. Kick off buddy, there you go. Sick, T-boned it. I was very late to the set. A little rusty, but we'll take it. Number two. Good job, Dad, you're up, bro. You're up. Whatever you want. That was a good cutty. Probably 16. Probably 18. Probably 15. Probably 14. What's good, everybody? Little update for the day. Joe just got a nice cutthroat, which is sweet. I've got a nice brown on my belt, so that's good. Yeah, yeah. And now I'm up, and uh, we'll keep floating. How are the vibes right now? We should have a vibe checker. Vibe check. Pretty, I think pretty good right now. Pretty in the green right now. Vibes good. So stay tuned. Mav's happy. Look, he's a happy boy. Look, he's so happy. Oh, yeah. Is if you're streamer fishing, and especially if you're streamer fishing with a buddy off of a boat like this, most definitely talk about what's going on. For sure. Don't like, if you have an idea, there he is. Yeah, nice. There we go. Got a boy. Nice cutty. I'm here. Had to be there. Nice, dude. Heck yeah. Cool, let's just show him up and let him right away. Okay. Get your hands wet first. Always wet your hands. Oh, what a cool one. Hey, Whoa. Hey. Bye, fish. Hot one. Happy. Talking was going to say, before that fish destroyed my streamer, you got to talk about it and add it up. By the end of the day, you should have enough information to know what, what's going on. What kind of water they're in. Where do you want it fast? They yes. Want it slow. And streamer fishing isn't, you're not always 100% effectively fishing a streamer. Usually what you want to do is be like super effective when it's time to be, which means okay here comes a dope little spot it looks really fishy you gotta be ready for it but how do you know it's a dope little spot well based off of the information from that day that you've learned a couple grabs are here and there or whatever you piece it together won't cast, please. okay won't cast oh my oh my god are you on yeah dude no Whoa, big nice fish. fish nice fish let him go you're kidding me you're kidding me dude it's a nice cutthroat i think no nice cut through. Oh, nice rainbow. It's a rainbow. A cup a cup Let me see. That? You got this, buddy. Whoa! 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 Ah! Oh my gosh! <sighs> nice rainbow. Shut up! Hot. That was a sweet eat. All of these fish today 
you piece it all together and you look at all their eats or takes, everything that's telling us anything, these fish are in the fast water, in the head of the run. So we have cutthroat, brown trout, rainbow trout, and they're all eating uh, a larger sex dungeon variation. It's something that we tie ourselves. It's definitely getting better the more we've fished. Early morning, not a lot of takes. Now, as soon as we kind of get lower in the float, sun's coming up, water's heating up. They get, they're get, they're getting, it seems like they're getting really excited and they're eating, eating the streamer pretty hard. So all we're fishing though is, uh, is a Squatch, nine foot eight weight. It's paired up with uh, Montucky by the Fly Project. Sweet little reel. We're fishing a Cortland Streamer Sink 10. So that's 10 foot of sink tip. Then it's a floating line. It's been working well. If you're fishing long leaders or you're fishing heavy flies or you're fishing sink tips, you need to beef up your rod, dude. I mean, I'm not necessarily saying the fish are huge and you have to have an eight weight to handle them, but to not stick it in your ear, to not hook your buddy rowing for you, you need to have an eight weight rod to launch that thing out there, get it in the right spot and be ready for the take. And honestly, some of these fish have been fighting really hard. So I'm pretty stoked to have an eight weight. There we go, boys and girls. Of course, I accidentally turned off the GoPro right before this fish ate. He got foul hooked because he came up and ate it from, from down low and he missed it and then I set, but that's all right. Still got him on the streamer. It's a solid brown, super solid brown. That was sick. Did you see it eat? You see him rose up? He rose up to it, dude. It was super sick. Get him, Brown! Woo! Solid Brown! Woo! That's a solid Brown. What a nice one. So sick. Cool. I'm proud of you, Joe. Thank you. I think it was your oar. <laughs> Joe! Dude! You okay? Figure it out, bud. Ow! Sorry. God. Bro. It's not in me, but good God. Man, watch out. Your casting days. Man, watch out. Figure it out. Sorry, man. I'm sorry. I'm better. I'm better. You are. That's why I'm mad at you. I would not be mad at you if you were ass hat. You're not ass hat. You're just behaving like an ass hat. Oh, yeah, you want to there? You want to rest? Hello, cast. After sticking me in the neck. Ah! I'll never get to catch a fish. Really? No. Got a chip on my shoulder forever. God dang it. Act like that never happened. Valid, valid. Always the beers. Can I get that beer though? If you're gonna hit a wall, I might as well hit it hard. Yeah. I'm not sure what's going on, dude. You're good, you're good. Let him run, let him run, let him run. Let him There's run. roots in there. Attaboy. That's a fish, dude. Oh my god. Oh my. Joe, it's, I think it's big. Dude, it might be big, buddy. Unless he's foul hooked. Dude, something's weird. 
Can I get out? What's going on? He's stuck in something. Really? I don't know. Oh God, no! He's just—he's just—he's just, 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 just big, dude. Big fish, Brad. Big fish. He's ripping. He's stuck over there. Oh, no. I'm getting you. I'm getting you. We're still tight though. We're still tight though. Dude, nice fish. Stick it down. Bring it to the net. Or anchor. He's gone. Oh no, he's right there. He's stuck on the bottom. He's stuck on the bottom. Grab that, yeah, drop the anchor, but there's a stick. We're right there is the stick. And pull it up again like I did and get it loose. And he's still on. There he is. Okay, as soon as this happens though, Give me, yeah, keep tension, good. Clear. One sec, one sec, keep tension. Let go. Now it's good. Yeah. Net's gone. Pretty good. Pretty good. There you go. Oh, oh. Please. It was insane. Oh, you're on the... I gotta watch this boat. Wow. That was the craziest... That was the craziest thing ever, dude. Insane. <laughs> stuck him, and then he got stuck in a roots ball, and he kind of was... And he's still on, and Joe gets out, and then he has to do the line, blah, blah. We got him. It's good. We're gonna get it back out there. He fought really hard. But this was amazing fish. Are you kidding? You cannot get better than that, dude. That's a sweet one. Amazing. Oh, wow. Look at how just perfect she is. She's perfect. Woo! Let's go. Let's go. Oh, I love this I love it. Nice. So, you're up. Let's go. Woo! Dude. Oh, it's a stick. Got it. That was a fish. I almost... It's because I didn't have my glasses on. All right, folks, there's a quick tip for you. It is cloudy, it is so dark, I can barely see. But you absolutely have to have low light lenses Bald on. Eagle. Bald eagle! Bald eagle! Because you won't see these snags. And you have to be able to see some snags. Yeah. No. Whoa. Oh my. That was so random. I told you, dude, they're starting to turn on with this, this storm just happened. <laughs> Look at the one little bat, one little root he was behind. Nice brown. It's actually a big brown, Joe. <laughs> That's a big back eddy up there. Okay. So either anchor before or after. Not a giant, but T-boned it. It was sick. There you go. <laughs> You're okay. You're okay. Grab the back end. There you go. We are absolutely hands down the biggest goofballs on the river. Any day you float, there's no you chance. Just died for that fish, Joe. <laughs> he jumped. That was so sick. <laughs> so sick. Look at that. That's a stunning fish. This is absolutely crush the streamer. We're gonna send him home, facing upstream. Storms rolling in. Fishing's getting good. Woo! Mavi missed him by probably about 30 feet. Let's go! Nice, Joe. That was a sick eat, dude. Super stoked you stuck him, bro. Super sick! I want to see a fish like do a triple backflip on a fly. Dude. Dude, that was the coolest thing. Was that cutting? That was a brown, dude. I just say too. I just said I want a brown to do a backflip on me. It's like, to my GoPro. <laughs> so I'm sorry. I, I'm sorry. I got mad at you, Joe. I'm sorry. <laughs> this, is, this, this is seriously insane. Look at this storm. It was zoomed in. Yep, it was zoomed in. Wow, that was crazy. The storm came in. 
pushed us out. We got out as fast as we could. We're on our way back home now. It was a really good day. I had, I had a great time, Joe. Dude, I had such a good day. We needed that. Days off together are always a blast. Yeah, we had a we had one day off where we weren't working in the shop or guiding, and we were just like, all right. Let's bomb. Let's go send it, and we did, and it turned out. And that goes to show if you want to catch some fish, sometimes you got to go on some big sends. you got to go do some, some interesting stuff in interesting places and try new things. Oh, yeah. And that's what we did. I've never floated that section of the river this time of year. It was very interesting. I learned something new. Learned a lot. <clears throat> I learned a lot about where fish hold and how much weather plays a, plays a factor. As soon as that storm came in, our fishing changed dramatically. Dude, that... It was amazing how it was like a lull and then for some reason it was like a 30 minute spike every fish was feeding and like we're we talking we took advantage of it fish doing backflips for your fly like yeah. coming out of the water it did not have to sink it was smack yeah. twitch 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 and this thing was like boiling on it which was so fun that's that's what we do that's what we live for when yeah it comes to that's so fun streamer fishing fish like just losing his mind over it makes you want to keep doing it um, definitely was the right bug to be thrown at that time I mean if a fish is behaving that way that's how you know it's definitely uh, the right bug. So <clears throat> we hope you enjoyed this video. We got lots more on the way. You guys have been so so supportive. We appreciate you so much. Thank you for making it to the end of the video. And close this one out, buddy. You got the big fish. Per usual. Thank you guys. Appreciate it. And we'll see you on the next one. Peace.